Will Solana hit $1,000 this bull run? A lot of analysts are saying, a lot of experts are saying it. So when is Solana going to hit $1,000 and why is it going to hit $1,000 for this upcoming bull run? Meaning within the next 12, 18 months, $1,000 Solana. It looks like we're about to have a gigantic breakout because Solana has kept up above the bullish range, which suggests the price could soon receive a significant influx of buying volume. We're about to look at this chart right here, everybody. The current trade setup suggests the bulls are accumulating gains as Solana is varying within a very narrow range ever since the token surpassed and secured support at $144. And now that we've been ranging high since the start of the day, it is believed to close the month on a bullish note as we've already confirmed the bottoms. Last time we had this previous pattern, we saw a thousand percent pump for Solana. And then back then we created an all-time high of $260. A thousand percent pump today would result in a $1,400 Solana. So let's look at these charts. You know, what are we talking about here? Can this happen? All right. So we're going to go ahead and look at this little bit of a bullish flag pennant forming, and we're going to see what kind of price range is going to give us here. And well, folks, I need to go ahead and warn you, there is an asterisk because you'll see here, we run out the pennant. Well, that only makes a $340 Solana. So, so where are they getting these moon math targets, everybody? Well, if we look a little bit more closely, you'll notice that this is a log chart. I am not the biggest fan of using uh, pennant formations for log charts. I think it's cheating. Uh, you, you know, you end up with a little bit of a too bullish of a narrative there. But if we were to run that out and just kind of run out something similar, look at that, over a thousand dollar Solana. So I wouldn't say uh, you know it is in the cards for this chart formation because this is a log chart. But can it hit a thousand dollars? Well, you know who else also thinks so? Raul Paul, everybody, the famous macro investor. He shared his bullish outlook for Solana as well. He's disclosing Raul Paul is 90% exposed to Solana. It looks like he's selling all his Ethereum, selling all his Bitcoin here, uh, reflecting his confidence in its long-term prospects here. Now he has a little bit of a, a little bit of a wedge formation forming here, which he says is going to anticipate a significant growth phase. And there's other reasons he's bullish on Solana. Their NFT compression technology, which will be really good if you're trying to release, you know, 100,000 of an NFT or even 10 million of an NFT, like a gift card to Starbucks. Uh, Blink, Fire Dancer, ZK Compression. So the chain itself is upgrading. There's more dApps on the upgrade. But he's not the only famous macro investor. We also got Zhu Su. He's the founder of the now defunct Three Arrows Capital. He is saying, why is no one talking about how Grayscale Solana Trust is implying a $1,000 Solana? The numbers are very similar when ETH was 200 but their Ethereum product implied $1,000. So he's saying basically we're setting up the same scenario where we got a $1,000 ETH from 200 very, very close to what we're seeing with Solana because Solana was just $200. Let's talk about that Grayscale Trust a little bit. Does the Grayscale Trust imply a $1,000 Solana? Well, it's a big resounding yes, actually. It's actually even higher than that. Uh, years back, the ETH Trust traded at a substantial premium when ETH's market price was around 200 That implied a $1,000 Ethereum. A target it later achieved. Today, the Solana Trust exhibits a similar premium, which some are going to forecast a comparable trajectory for Solana. Basically, they're saying the math then was looking really bullish. Well, what is the math today? Let's do the math today. One G soul, not asking for your soul here, but I would ask for a like button. Why don't you go ahead and hit that? One grayscale Solana trust share, $421. Well, you would then say, well, what does that mean? Like three Solana per trust? No, it is less than that. It's actually closer to a third. You can see right here, we scroll down, Solana per share, 0.37. So we do this math to see how many trusts equal one Solana. So you need 2.6 to have one Solana's worth. Well, if we multiply the price of the trust here, $421 per share, well, folks, that is implying a $1,000 Solana, $1,123 to be exact. So Grayscale Premium also implying $1,000 Solana, making it just a lot more likely than other people are assuming here. We also have another analysis. Uh, this person is talking about the Solana dominance chart, noting at peak market cap, it didn't even crack 3%. Well, I looked at Solana dominance, it went a little bit above that. I mean, we're looking at the three day here. This is Solana dominance, and we're currently sitting at about 3%. But I want to do uh, you know, a little bit of a more analysis here. He's visioning a scenario where Solana could enter a parabolic rally phase. Could we see that? Well, folks, I can't help but notice a little bit of another bullish pattern. Does look like we got a little bit of a, a bull flag pennant forming. Will this play out? I mean, no one knows for sure. But I mean, it's really, really uh, dubious to do this with dominance charts. However, 
I would like a, a 5, 5.7% 5 uh, dominance for Solana. It gives us close to a 6% dominance for Solana. Let's just round down and say it's 5%. I'd be very happy with Solana having a 5% market cap dominance. If we were to hit, you know, some numbers are saying, you know, potential 10 trillion. But if we come in a little lower, say crypto market cap hits $5 trillion, you're looking at a $250 billion market cap for Solana. $250 billion, pretty substantial increase from $70 billion. But if I give a little bit of a warning, uh, I will say we do have a little bit of uh, some bearish divergences here, meaning, you know, it looks like the market maybe wants to, uh, you know, push this down. Uh, we want to see a bullish divergence here, meaning the RSI, the relative strength index, is heading up as the price went down. We're seeing the opposite of that, which could be seen as a bearish sign. And when you go to Ethereum, well, you're actually seeing the opposite, you know, so maybe Solana's pain is Ethereum's strength here, with the price, you know, kind of headed down as the RSI headed up. So, you know, uh, when it comes to Soul ETH, well, it looks like Solana might be giving some headway to Ethereum in the short term. So I do want to just, you know, maybe give you a little bit of caution right there. But one last price prediction where we could see $1,000 Solana is the Solana Bitcoin trading pair. Now, last time we were in a consolidation pattern, then Solana jumped against Bitcoin. You can just see that, that massive, massive candle right there. And then you saw another consolidation period followed by another nice little jump. Now, if we were to, you know, maybe just come in with a, a much smaller pump, that was a 500% pump. What if we came in with a 200% pump? Well, folks, I'm going to see a little bit of confluence that I wanted to share with you guys here. Look at the 10,000 Satoshi level. Every 10,000 Satoshis, looks like Solana takes a little bit of a pause. Uh, I think there's a lot of traders who are watching the relative strength of Solana versus Bitcoin. And you can see every time we hit 10,000 sats, Solana has a little bit of action. Right now, using 20,000 sats as support here, and then using 30,000 sats as resistance, I have a prediction, you know, if we get a 200% pump, that is 60,000 sats. So one Solana would be worth 60,000 sats. And if we have a $150,000 Bitcoin, that means one Solana would be roughly this much value, giving us a $900 Solana. So yeah, I think Solana very easily could hit $1,000. There's a lot of things pointing to these levels, but do not wait for Solana to hit $1,000. Do not be afraid to take some profits on the way up. And you know what? I'll see you, and hopefully your diamond-handed Solana bags at the top.